Hi, it's Aditya at Lazy Code Lab and in this video, I will show you that you can set up your Shopify store in theme ko apne local system. Pe set up kaise kar sakte hai. This can be really helpful if you want to learn theme development or you are already working on a live project par kaam kar rahe hai, as it can really improve your productivity. One of the benefits of setting up your theme locally is that we can work on our theme offline which I think is really neat. Okay, so before we get started, make sure you have Ruby and Git CLI installed in your system. If you are not sure whether they are installed or not, you can quickly confirm that using a command prompt by typing in ruby-v which will return Ruby ka version return karega, and git space version जो कि हमें git cli का version return करेगा अगर आपको भी similar values return हो रही हैं that means you have both of the clis installed correctly in your system however अगर आपको error show हो रहा है then please make sure to download the respective clis from the links in the description below now we can install another CLI package called Shopify CLI. Isko install karne ke liye hum Ruby CLI ka istamal karenge. For that we can type in gem install Shopify CLI and hit enter and it will take 30 seconds to a minute to install depending on your internet speed. We can confirm that the package is correctly installed by typing in Shopify space version and if it returns some numbers like you can see on the screen that means our Shopify CLI properly installed ho chuka hai. Let's authenticate the Shopify CLI so that it can Shopify store. So to authenticate karne ke liye, we have to type in this command Shopify space login dash dash store space and after this space you need to enter the url of your shopify store so in this example i'm going to use my dummy shopify store url so i'm just going to copy this url from here and in the terminal i am going to paste it and then hit enter and as you can see i have successfully logged into shopify cli and now i can close this tab and in the command prompt, I can see that my authentication was successful. Okay, so we have successfully authenticated kar liya hai and now we can see and download the themes which are available in our store. Hai. And to do that, we need the command Shopify theme pull. So let's type it in Shopify theme pull and hit enter. As you can see, it's showing me six themes right now. And to navigate up and down between these themes, I can use the key K and J on my keyboard. J to go down and K to go up. And just to confirm, if I go back to my Shopify store, we can see that we have all these themes available. Now by pressing enter, I can start downloading the theme from Shopify to my local computer. However, I do theme ko is current directory mein download nahi karna chata, So I am going to exit out of it. All right, so I am in the correct directory now and I am going to run the same command again. Shopify theme, oops, pull. And uh, from this list, I think I sense theme ko download karunga. When it's highlighted in blue, you can press enter and as you can see it's pulling theme file from sense so we will let it download so theme download ho chuki hai now is theme ko locally run karne ke liye hum shopify cli ki ek command shopify space theme space serve use karenge it will take some time to sync the theme with the online store. So as you can see, it's port 9292 pe hamara ek local server start kar diya hai. And if we press control and click on it, it will open up my dummy store locally. Seems like it's password protected. I'm just going to enter the password for my store. And sure enough, it's working as expected. Now let's try to edit the theme in a code editor and put changes karke dekhte hai. Let's try to make some changes in the main theme file. 
सो फॉर टेस्टिंग पर्पज मैं सिर्फ पेज का टाइटल चेंज करूंगा सो लेट्स चेंज इट टू अपडेटेड टाइटल वन टू थ्री फोर or anything and as soon as i save it in the terminal it will tell us that the changes that we made are synced so iska matlab hai ki hamare sare changes jo hum locally kar rahe hain wo hamare shopify server pe bhi update ho chuke hain so let's check it out and well you can see already here that the title has been updated to updated title 1 2 3 4 which is really amazing we didn't even have to refresh the page so it's working as expected agar aap ek custom shopify theme par kaam karna chahte hain to hum wo bhi badi aasani se kar sakte hain uske liye hame ek custom shopify theme boilerplate download karna padega to let's do that right now maine ek naya custom theme ka folder bana liya hai and from this folder main ek terminal open karunga and is terminal mein i will type in shopify theme in it आफ्टर प्रेसिंग एंटर ये आपसे पूछेगा कि थीम का नाम क्या रखना है फॉर नाउ आई विल कॉल इट एल सी एल थीम एंड एज यू कैन सी इट्स क्लोनिंग दिस बॉयलर प्लेट फ्रॉम गेट हब इन टू अ फोल्डर कॉल्ड एल सी एल थीम इस फोल्डर को अगर हम खोलें तो हम देख सकते हैं कि थीम प्रॉपरली डाउनलोड हो चुकी है अब मैं अपने टर्मिनल से इस फोल्डर में नेविगेट करूंगा ताकि मैं शॉपिफाई थीम सर्व कमांड रन कर सकूँ because if we have to run this command we have to be inside the theme folder okay great so syncing is done now i'm going to press control again and click on this link and sure enough we have our custom shopify theme running locally now you can go ahead and open your code editor and us pe aap apne changes kar sakte hain and jab aapki theme ready ho jaye then you can simply go back to your theme folder and you can compress it and go back to your store and from the add theme section you can upload your theme file and it will show up here ये वीडियो काफी स्पेसिफिक एंड ब्रीफ थी बट यू कैन डू अ लॉट मोर विद शॉपिफाई सी एल आई एंड इट्स कमांड सो दिस इज इट फॉर दिस वीडियो एंड अगर आपको इसमें कुछ समझ ना आया हो या आपकी कोई और क्वारी हो देन डू लेट मी नो इन द कमेंट सेक्शन बिलो आई वुड हाईली रिकमेंड चेकिंग आउट ऑफिशियल शॉपिफाई डॉक्यूमेंटेशन वेबसाइट जहाँ पर आप और भी डिटेल्स पा सकते हैं शॉपिफाई सी एल आई के रिगार्डिंग I have all the links in the description below. You can support Lizzy Code Lab by subscribing to our YouTube channel or by simply posting a comment below. Thanks for watching and keep coding.